Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shirley and today I want to talk to you about the cast of Hocus Pocus. You got, you guessed it guys, I've been on this Hocus Pocus for a long time and I'm just glad it launched. It gives me a reason to talk about it. Once again, I am wearing my Hocus Pocus lipstick and this one is Mary, nope, I'm sorry, this one is Winnie, um, the Winnie one. And then here's the lip liner. You guys know that I don't wear red, but I happen to like this and I think being Hocus Pocus, <laughs> it makes me like it a lot better. But I only wear it here when I've been talking to you guys, haven't had enough guts to wear it to work yet. So I got my nails done. Um, at nighttime, the top will glitter in the dark. Glitter in the dark. No, glow in the dark. And I've been wearing my um, earrings, my Halloween. So I have my jewelry, my tub of jewelry out that is all about Halloween. I'll be wearing my tattoos every Friday like I always do. I'll be getting those out here probably tomorrow night. I am ready for Halloween. As I told you guys before, I love, love, love it. So, guys, let's talk about the cast of Hocus Pocus. Well, we all know who the Sanderson sisters are. Um, the main one is Winnie, and that is Bette Milder. And then there's Sarah Jessica Parker, which is Sarah. And then there is the middle sister, who is Kathy Najimi, who plays Mary. So I've done a lot of research, and I just kind of want to tell you about the cast. And um, I, think, I think it's really interesting from where they were 27 years ago to where they are now. As you guessed, um, Hocus Pocus, the movie just amplified their career. Uh, Bette Milder already had a very good career going. So let's talk about Bette Milder first. Then we'll talk about um, Kathy Najimi, who plays Mary. And then we'll talk about Sarah Jessica Parker. So 27 years ago in 1993, Bette Milder was... Um, 47 years old and she played the witch the main witch she's now 74 guys she looks freaking fabulous i don't know where i'm going to put her picture but her picture is is going to be on here i'm going to be inserting lots of them so we all know that hocus pocus number two is coming out it was supposed to be out this month but due to covid it did not make it so they are now planning to release it in June of 2021. You guys, I am so excited. I'm going to have like the party. I'm going to grab all of my Hocus Pocus friends and I hope we can all make it there together. It's going to be fantabulous. So, and she just says, I can't wait to fly again. Dude, she's going to be 74 and she's going to be flying. That woman is awesome and she's beautiful. Just love her. So, um... She was, let's see here, um, she has been married once and she has one kid. She has gotten four Golden Globe Awards, three Grammy Awards, one um, or three Primetime Awards. And her kid's name is Sophie. I am so like Uda and over she has played so many good movies I just can't believe at the age of 74 she's returning to the screen I can't wait guys so let's talk about Kathy Kathy Najimi she plays Mary so she first started her career um, in sister act in 1992 she played as a nun <laughs> so Kathy is now 63 years old and she was um, 55, or she, so she is 63 and 27 years ago, I didn't write it down, um, how she was 36 is what she was when she played um, the Sanderson sister. So in 1976, just, just some fun facts about these characters, I dug as much as I could. So in 1976, um, Kathy was on the Family Feud game, 
and she won the grand prize or they won I don't know if it was a whole family I think it probably was and they won ten thousand dollars that was the grand prize but a couple of years later um, or a couple years before that in 1974 she played on the 20,000 pyramid and lost all she won was a home Commodore 64 uh, computer no money so she is married and also has one kid so um, her big break back in the day was sister act and that was in 1992 and she also played guys I didn't know this she also played Peggy's voice in um, the King of the Hill from 1997 to 2010 that's pretty sweet so now let's talk about Sarah Jessica Parker. You guys, we all know Sarah Jessica Parker. She is just freaking fabulous. So when she starred as her, which she was um, 28 years old, she is now 55. She's beautiful. She's only a couple years older than me, and she's just downright drop dead gorgeous. So um, she was mostly famous for doing her Sex in the City um, series from 1998 to 2004. So she has won two Emmys, four Golden Globes, the Best Actress in the Comedy Series, three Screen Actors Guild Awards, and later she was recognized as one of the greatest female characters in the American television. That is one accomplished woman, guys, if you ask me. So way back in 1983, my neighbor, um, I used to have blonde hair and it was long and I would go over there and ask her to French braid it all the time. Her name was Kathy. So her husband was a truck driver and I would go over there and she, we would just, sometimes we would have pizza, sometimes we would just hang out. She would do my hair for the most of it and she bought this movie and she wanted me to watch it. Well, that was one of the very first Sarah Jessica Parker movies I ever seen of her I loved her in that movie and now I think it's on Amazon Prime and I'm going to go find it and probably watch it tomorrow because I haven't seen it probably for came out in 83 so what is that um, 37 38 years ago that's when I first seen her in that she was a young kid so anyway guys go check that out it's called somewhere tomorrow and um, she has a total of 37 movies that she has made. So, and I didn't know this, um, so I'm going to have to go check this out either. And I didn't take any screenshots. So if I, if I do it before I upload, I definitely will. But she played Rusty in Footloose in 1984. That's pretty cool too. And I love Footloose. So obviously I haven't seen that in a while because I kind of forgot who Rusty was so now I need to go check that out so let's talk about a couple of other main characters so let's talk about um, the only other three that I'm going to talk to you about well I'll talk to you about a couple other ones so let's talk about Max Dennison he's his real name is Omri Katz O-M-R-I last name K-A-T-Z and I did a lot of searching on him, and he really doesn't have a lot of searching to be done. He is pretty um, to himself, basically, I think. So I couldn't find if he ever got married or if he is gay or anything. So I also want to tell you that um, Mary Kathy Nemeji also is very big into the LBGT community. She's very much an activist. She does live in California. So let me back up. Let me go back to Max Dennison. So he was 17 years old when he played this role, and um, he is a retired actor. He is retired, guys, but he is returning for a Hocus Pocus number two. That's freaking awesome. Um, he also lives in California. So when he first started his movie career, he was on Dallas. Do you guys remember that soap opera Dallas with J.R. Uh, Ewing? Well, he played Sue and J.R. Ewing's son from 
1983 to 1991. He is currently a hairdresser in LA. I couldn't find anything else, like if he was married, if he had kids, um, what else he done. So I have a picture of him here somewhere as well. So let's talk about his sister in the movie, Danny. And her name is Thora Birch. So Thora is now 38 years old. And, um, I don't know if she'll be returning. It wasn't said. She first got her, um, career started when she played in the kids' movie Purple Peter Eater. And then she played in Hocus Pocus, and then she played in Walking Dead. She has one Screen Actors Guild Award and two, uh, Young Hollywood Awards and one Toronto Film Critics Association Award. That's pretty good too. So um, she is kind of low key. It didn't say that she had any kids. She is married though, and I don't know if she'll be returning. So um, now let's talk about Allison the love of um, Max. Max just really liked her and her yabos. So her real name is Vanessa Shaw. She is now 44 years old. She's been married for 12 years. She doesn't uh, have any kids and um, she will be returning to the screen for Hocus Pocus number two. There will be new faces for Hocus Pocus number two. So let's just go back. So we have all three of the witches. Um, we don't know. Max is returning. We don't know if Danny is returning for sure. Um, Allison is returning. So let's. T um, I don't know about um, Billy if he will be returning. He is also in my screen. And there's a picture of him then and now. I couldn't really find on a lot of wards or any more information on him as well. He is still around. Jay is still around. Um, the bully, the long blonde haired bully. Please see the pictures then and now. And then so is Ice. There's a picture of him then and now. Didn't say if they're returning. So there will be new faces. So we just got to wait. And as soon as I find more information on these I will definitely let you know so then the mom Alice um, Danny and Max's mom the mom is still around I couldn't find a lot of information on her the dad um, he is no longer around he committed suicide in 05 I think I read very sad so definitely a new face coming for him I'm not sure they were trying to figure out where or how it's going to pick back up in Hocus Pocus number two. Um, they wouldn't say anything going on. There was um, trailers that was going to be re uh, released. I couldn't watch them, couldn't find them. So guys, I will post when I find out, as soon as I find out. I love Hocus Pocus and I hope you guys enjoy Hocus Pocus like I do. I hope you guys enjoyed this little update. If you did, please give me thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And also, please turn your notification bell on so that way you never miss an upload and you know what's kind of going on in my crazy, crazy world right now. Tomorrow, I will be posting a review on makeup. So guys, we will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. I appreciate you. You guys have a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Hey, guys. I forgot to tell you, when I was searching, um, researching stuff last night, I found the Sanderson Sisters quiz. And it wanted you to take the quiz to see how much of a Sanderson sister you are. So, I will put the link down below in my comments. So, check that out. And also, my score at the very, very end. Guys, thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.